Night Bazaar is a great way to get out into the community and enjoy a gorgeous summer evening. The Valley Today's Abby Furchner joins us live from where it's all going to be going down tonight. Good morning, Abby. Good morning, Lisa and Jordan. I'm here on 5th Street North, where tonight from 5 to 9, Night Bazaar is going to be going on, and they're going to have so much from live music to food trucks to uh, vendors and crafters like Pete Sand. And you have some really cool artwork, some steel and some glass work. How did you get, get into this type of art? Uh, the steel work, I kind of fell into. A friend of mine bought the machine and uh, let me play with it, and I found that I really liked doing it. And... It just kind of became a business from there on. The rest is history. I absolutely love that. I want to talk about your glass piece that's sitting over there because you were saying how once the lights are installed, it will actually light up. Yeah, it, uh, they're all set up with LED lights um, that have uh, different ways you can program them for chase scenes and stuff like that with 44 different colors. Wow. So even if you don't have it in a window where it catches the light, it'll still light up and look really nice. And then your steel pieces too, like the cash only you have there. Yeah, go ahead and grab that. How long does something like this take you? Because I know you were saying you have to kind of redraw everything. Um, it, yeah, it really depends on the artwork that I find or what I want to work off of. Yeah. Um, because if somebody's drawing something out, it doesn't always transfer over to what I'm doing. Because you have to have the eyes can't just float out in the middle of nothing. <laughs> they'll fall right out. So you've got to find ways to attach them and make them look natural so it actually looks like the person. I've had more of these not turn out yeah. than actually have turned out. So Artwork is a lot of trial and error, and I love the Go Herd, Go Bison. That's a great one to have here in the Fargo community. But you'll just want to come out, check out Pete's vendor or stand. He's just one of the vendors that will be here out of the many. But it's going to be a fun time here tonight. Come out and enjoy that summer evening. I love it. Lots of fun stuff out there. Abby Furchner reporting live for us. Thank you.